If you don't eat, you'll die. Fact. Which is why I'm gonna open a restaurant in my house. Oh yeah, this is my house. We all know people don't show up to restaurants unless they have great reviews. So I'm going to buy fake reviews to rank number one in my city and see if people actually show up. So how are we gonna do that? <laughs> <laughs> Glad you asked. I made a fake Google restaurant and spent $500 buying 100 fake reviews. That yep. has to be illegal. Uh, well. Eric, you broke a law and then you just admitted to it in 4K. Either Google shuts down our restaurant and this whole video is destroyed or 100 five-star reviews in 24 hours makes us the number one restaurant in LA. Now I don't know how to cook, so we need to find a chef. So I put on an application on my Instagram, like 300 people responded and we found this guy, Jake, and I think he would be a great fit. I'm gonna call him right now. Hopefully our chef, Jake! Yo, Eric, what's up, dude? <laughs> First, I read a little bit about your bio. Basically, we wanna open a restaurant with you. Uh... Okay. <laughs> so the idea is to buy a bunch of fake reviews to see if people actually show up to our restaurant and I have 100 so far. So you're saying if we get more reviews, then more people are going to show, right? Exa yeah, exactly. Then we need to get way more. We're going to blow this thing. <laughs> I like this guy's ambition. So when? Probably like uh, tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's tomorrow. There he is. <laughs> What's up, bro? Dude, That's I can't the believe, biggest smile I ever. I can't seen. believe we're right here right now. This is insane. And it was time for Jake and I to hit the streets with these flyers I had made to get even more fake reviews. We look like we're trying to convert somebody to a different religion out here. <laughs> Holy, God. that's a wolf. Hey, how's it going? My brother, I just opened a restaurant and I'm wondering if you could scan this and leave us a five-star review. All right. Okay, I thought we couldn't get a stronger reaction. He was crying. Could you leave us a five-star review? Thank you so much. Did we get him? I mean, dude, the, the flyer was soaking wet with tears. Why is everybody crying? So you're gonna leave us a review? You certainly will. Okay. Right. Yeah, just scan this right here. <laughs> hey, could you guys leave us a five-star review? So I'm opening a restaurant and I need reviews. I'm dead serious. Hey, can I get you guys to scan this? Yeah, man. Tell your friends. Okay. Tell your friends. Okay, thanks. Okay, listen, the mom with our back to us right now, smoke show. <laughs> I inquired about her significant other. She said she had one, but I didn't believe her. <laughs> Jake, you're just saying that because you want to date her. And after begging for even more fake reviews, we needed to make sure that Jake wasn't a serial killer. All right, so this is dinner for us tonight. I prepared this for you. This is so cute. Little candlelight dinner for the boys. So we just got some <laughs> Taco Bell that I ordered. So what's your story? Why are you doing this? So I had a job. Okay. I got let go of my job two months ago. So things have been really tough. I was never really like happy in what I was doing full time. <clears throat> and so once I found social media, I felt happier just in general. And I was able to like create things without having to kill myself. So now that I want to pursue this full time, it's like, I'm not making any money. I'm trying to scrape it all together to make it work. And so for you, what, what is the backup option? There is no backup option. <laughs> There's no backup option. Okay. This is it. If this doesn't work, I, I'm gonna have to move out. I could be in some serious trouble. It all comes down to tomorrow night. Do you feel prepared? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> tomorrow, we are going to spend as much money as we need at the grocery store in the morning. We're gonna turn this place into a restaurant and launch your career. Let's go. I'll see you bright and early. The next morning, I rolled out of bed, checked my phone, and sure enough, <laughs> the fake reviews worked. We are the number one restaurant in Los Angeles right now. I guess we gotta go get groceries. What do we need? Just enough. I think I think we're good. Okay. So six cucumbers, a bunch of cilantro. Listen, I eat Chef Boyardee. I have garlic at my house. I can give it to you. Really? I'm eating. I'm Eric. Nice Great to meet you. Too. You want to come over and look at my garden and pick some vegetables? Hey! Garden of Eating. The seeds come out and they're poisonous on the inside. You can only eat the outside. So I don't what? do it because I don't want to die. Are you sure there's no seeds in there? <laughs> there might be. So the food is being cooked. Uh, if you guys haven't noticed already, we are in a new house. Oh my God. Welcome to the Mafia headquarters. We just moved in this month. If you guys have been following, you know a year ago, Mac and I started sleeping on a mattress in a room in LA. And finally, it paid off. We actually shot a celebration bit for this earlier, but there was no audio. <laughs> we just have confetti in the ceilings now. But I just wanted to pause and say thank you to you guys. All of this is possible because of you. And this, the, the new headquarters, is just the beginning. I'm not going to stop until the Mafia has 1 billion subscribers strong. That being said, I have not asked Hayden yet, but I think we have a lot of reservations. My phone has not stopped ringing for the past <laughs> five hours. This lady has been trying to call me for an hour to make reservations. Calling for tonight, Lori and Rick. I'm concerned this house is going to be way <laughs> too full, dude. <laughs> dude, as long as Lori and Rick are going, let's freaking go. I do have some good news, though. The party rentals did just get here, so if you want to help me set up, we can get this party going. 
While Jake worked in the kitchen, we built a restaurant with our bare hands. Bro, what are you doing? That's uh, one out of like 20 tables. What are you doing, bud? What are you doing? Get away. Dude, you're mixing plastic with the metal fork. Well, the only thing we have left is two forks. <laughs> Look at all these tables. How are we supposed to do this with two forks? <laughs> Meanwhile, back in the kitchen. Oh, yeah. This is like the riso yaki. So this is like Japanese style risotto. Hey, Jake. Hey. Could you just about to walk in here? Okay. It's a strange guy. Uh, yeah. Just brace yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, oh my god, this looks like heaven. I miss you! <laughs> What's up, brother? You are a chef? Yeah. We are going to taste your food and rate you if you are good enough. Our time was up and it was time to open the abyss. Oh, y'all look fabulous! Yeah. Yeah. Hi, how are you? This is Spadius. Hey. He's Hi. missing an eyebrow from a previous video. Yeah. Oh, well, that's nice okay. To meet nice you. to meet you. You are very beautiful. Wow. <laughs> Why is it called the abyss? That reminds me. Welcome to the abyss! Tonight is the night we've all been waiting for. We have more reservations than we know what to do with. We have three of the greatest servers on the planet, my money-hungry producer Hayden, and the greatest chef to walk the earth, and Edie. And almost immediately, people were showing up. I cannot believe this word, bro. Name? Dalton? I don't have you guys on here. Apparently Hayden has made a list. Those guys were not on the list. So we're, just, we're gonna let them in, but they might be fans. We just let them do our actual house. Yeah, our creamy <laughs> The place is filling up, huh? Our reviews and our flyers were working almost too well. Boys, great news. We're fully booked okay. and all the tables are taken up. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Bad news, we have like 10 or 12 more people that are supposed to show up. So it's couches and our office chairs. It worked too well. I don't know what to say. I mean, the video, I don't We know. reached max capacity. We were turning people away. People were showing up to our house because of these stupid reviews. On the floor. That's in the room. This is just tap water. This is not anything fancy here. I'm going to tell people that this water is from the Colorado River. Fresh water from the Colorado River right here. Really? Oh, yeah, God. Yeah. Grand Canyon Appreciate water. It would never give you boss water. That's right. disgusting. <laughs> Enjoy that. My competitor, Hayden Hillier Smith, is outside. So uh, I'm gonna spit in the water. I see oh. uh, you're still editing for YouTube, and I'm now a waiter. Yep. It might have worked out for one of us better than the other. Definitely uh, didn't spit in this water. This is just food on the dryer over here. <laughs> you look a little stressed. Yeah, it's just a lot happening right now, but you know what? <laughs> We're persevering, right? We're one fussed it. Okay, okay, I'm trying. So definitely not enough for 42 people. What do we do? Okay, go, we get go. the risotto on the plate, okay? And it was time for the food to start going out, starting with the flaming hot first course. Yeah. Enjoy that, guys. I feel like you're a YouTuber. That's definitely not me. No, that's not me. <laughs> no, that, that was good. He's a mafia member over there. Our savory second course. <laughs> this is you, yes. Thank you. Oh, wow. I've Desert. seen every single one of your videos. I you. <laughs> I'm not a YouTuber. I don't know why you keep saying that. I know what's happening. No. The $1,000 third course. Oh my God. That is so dangerous. That's for you, my brother. Here we go. I'm sure you're going to enjoy that a lot. Open wide. Big tunnel. That is not how five star restaurants work at all. And the final fourth course. Here we go. Here we go. All right, here we go, boys. You guys, these are the last two plates of the entire night. Last two plates for you. Guys. We had served an entire restaurant full of people, but now we had to find out if we had lived up to our legal and fake five-star reviews. How's our food right here? It's excellent. The cooking temperature is perfect. This is very good food. I really it like it. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I love the arancini. Delicious. Uh -huh. It's the best thing I've ever had. It's the best thing you've ever had. If you open up a restaurant, I'm investing. How many stars? Five? 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 I think that's a five star restaurant. I think. Four and a half. <laughs> okay. Five. Yeah, five. Let's go! We've done it. Can't believe it. Sorry, I sorry. can't believe it. Thanks for coming. I love cooking food for people. This is like what I love to do. Like this experience is like super, super special. Thanks to Eric. We do that one more thing that we always do at the, at the end. Oh no. 
As you know, Jake here has been going through some tough times and I wanna make a habit of helping fellow Mafia members' dreams come true. I did not tell Jake I was doing this, but I'm going to put the link to his channel in the top of the description. I know the power of you guys, I know the power of the Mafia. You guys saved me from an abandoned island, you guys helped me go from zero to a million subscribers in a year. We have done things that nobody thought could be done. We've built one of the strongest communities on the platform and now I would love to make Jake's dreams come true. Mafia. Yes, sir! I'm sending you guys to Jake's YouTube channel. It's the first link in the description. I wanna surprise Jake and I have him wake up to like 100,000 subscribers. The Mafia is so strong and I'm asking you guys to please change Jake's life the way that you have changed my life. The partner that helped make this entire video possible is Shopify, which is crazy. I've been a fan of Shopify for years. I've opened so many different types of Shopify stores. The first time I quit my job years ago was because I was buying and selling hoverboards on Shopify. I drop ship t-shirts. The Mafia merch store is built on Shopify. Any business that I've had, all my friends, we all use Shopify because their mission is so similar to ours, which is arm the rebels and helping people make their dreams come true. Ah, dude, I love it. Shopify is so cool. In fact, that they want to help another one of our mafia members dreams come true. So the second link in the description is a place where you can tell us more about you, more about what you're working on. And we want to help you make your dreams come true as well. So number one, help Jake get to 100K. Number two, tell us about what you're working on and help me make your dreams come true. And if you guys help Jake, I will help you guys too. All right, back to the video. Well, we opened an actual restaurant in our house, uh, bought a bunch of fake reviews and you guys came, but we served real food. Shout out to Jake Algart for following on Instagram. That's pretty much it. I'm leaving. Okay.